This is Everyday Life with Rook and Fee. No. Come on, man. We in the building. We in our spot. We in our new spot. This is our first time shooting it. Actually, our second time. But this is our first time officially, like, in our spot, nigga. So let's go. Let's go. Let's get it, OG. If niggas is like that, they gonna have to try to knock us out our spot, baby. So this is our shit right here, man. Let's go. Man, how you feeling today, man? Look like you feeling pretty good. Man, look, OG, I'm so damn lit right now. <laughs> I can't even cap. I'm so lit right now just from, you know, everything that we've... The past 90 days. Yes. My nigga, 90 days. It's been 90, a great 90 days. In the past 90 days, bro, i just been so overwhelmed, like, with, yeah. with, with, with happiness and, and, like, yo, I can't believe this shit is... It's unfolding like it is, you know what I mean? Yeah. When you when you doing something and, and it's meant for you, yeah. blessings just unfold, unfold, unfold without you even having, without you even having to ask for them. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So with that being said, bro, it's like like the, the good Lord just been sending plenty of blessings our way, man. And and you know, we know without with, without God, none of this would even be possible. So the first biggest shout out go to God, big G O D. Man, Believe this man it. over here preaching. You Come on, me? man. He preaching over there. Come on, man. Let me hear that happy. Song. I'm happy, my nigga. How your mental state right now? Man, I'm feeling great, man. You know what I'm saying? Got to see my son this week. You know what I'm saying? Got yeah. to celebrate with him. You know what I'm saying? Got to let off some rounds yesterday. And, man, that would feel great to let off some rounds. You know what I'm saying? Just to release some pressure. How many, how many sticks y'all have out there? Man, we had about four sticks out there. Yeah, Lord, four man, sticks. About eight bangles out there. And we <laughs> just let them go. Country shit. Yeah, down in the backwoods. Yeah. Down yeah. there on our land. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so, ours, nigga. 40 acres of the mule, nigga. They ain't had to give it to us. Hey, we worked hard and got it anyway. We got our own, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> so how was your Thanksgiving, though, bro? Uh, shit, honestly? Ah, uh, some shit. It went bad. It went bad. It wasn't. It wasn't the best situation for me. Yeah. Uh, you know, Thanksgiving is a time where shit's supposed to be like that. You know, and it yeah. went bad for, for you know. But me, you made me, it through. My, yeah, I made it through. You know what I'm saying? You, you know, came out of that sweet. But it opened my eyes to a lot of shit. Oh. You know what I mean? Anybody out there, if you in a situation with somebody else and your significant other, and you don't feel like you respect it. If you don't feel like, you know, if you feel like you're getting talked to any kind of way and, and you just, and they just don't get it, get the fuck up out of there, man. Mm. I ain't going to cap you out. You know what I mean? I'm going to keep it all the way real with you, man. Because if you didn't show them a million times and they didn't, and y'all didn't talk, 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 talk a million times and it ain't got through their head a million times, you got to walk, my nigga. So that's what it is, man. So that's yeah. that's my advice for you. So that's how my Thanksgiving went. Yeah. But after that, we pulled it together. OG yeah. come pick me up yesterday. <laughs> but we went, went to Walmart, got that bird, got them uh, got them Hawaiian rolls. Shout out to T. T told us to get the off-brand Hawaiian rolls from Walmart. Straight out of Walmart. And Walmart them got hoes good, they got some good rolls over there, too. And them hoes is hitting. Man, believe that, man. got so, that lemon pepper chicken. And yeah. we slicing it up like old time. Got the, got the kick with old big... Yeah, South. we big South shout out because of man, yeah. That, that's how my Thanksgiving went. It went better the next day. So yeah, I, I did. How, how was yours? Man, I loved. It. I got to get in the kitchen with my mom. You know, made some you know broccoli casserole. No, you did. You know what I'm saying? Made some macaroni and cheese, and I made some stuffing muffins. You know what I'm saying? So the fuck is stuffing muffins? Stuffing muffins <laughs> is when you put them in that little muffin muffin tray. Yeah, you oh, got you, got you, the muffin tray. <laughs> the muffin okay, tray, you know what I'm saying? So hey, and them things was popping, you hear me? <laughs> man, I ate so much, man. Thursday night, man, after the Cowboys got their head busted, man, I laid across the bed. Them niggas is just a disappointment. Yeah, man, I laid across the bed, man. We're going to get to them. But I laid across <laughs> that bed, you hear me? Yeah. Man, I was fooled. You hear me? <laughs> I was fool. Yeah, had the itis, did Man. Look, the only, itis. Thing, the only thing I could do was pull back the covers and get in the bed. Damn. That's it. Yeah. Won't no extracurricular activity. <laughs> you know what I mean? Won't no extra. If she wanted to, she was going to have to do it. You if you <laughs> understand what I mean, you that means you was, you was going to have to do it. Now, that means I wasn't going to coerce you. Take that it means home. you was going to have to coerce me, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So 
if you won't try, definitely. I won't try. You hear with me? Definitely. I was definitely. good. You know what I'm saying? Definitely. <laughs> I definitely. was definitely good. So Thanksgiving was a was a win win for you all the way, man. Win win. Come on. That's all we do is win. Hey man, shout out to Mama Fountain. <laughs> she uh she got some of the best uh. I don't I, I nut shoes. Nut shoes. I call them nutter butters. <laughs> nut shoes. Oh my fucking god. Shout out to Mama Fountain. Some of the best nut shoes you ever gonna get. That's what it is, man. And they uh, will be on the market real soon. I'm trying to tell you. Real soon. Shout out to Bold Black and Beautiful. Oh man. Oh, oh she man. is stunning today. 730 y'all. entertainment. Man. Shout out to 730 entertainment. Politics with great. Come on, man. We 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 live here today. Talking sports with Mike and Quan. Yeah. All that's coming up next. Yeah. But to our team, we say thank y'all. Thank y'all. You know what I'm saying? Without, 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 without y'all, said it. without y'all, it ain't no us. It ain't no us. You know what I'm saying? We we appreciate. Hey, shout out to um, Kingston. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Shout out Michael. You know what I'm saying? To our <laughs> love homeboys, you know, getting this home. You know what I'm saying? They online. They online you know learning. <laughs> they getting this. <laughs> Uh, on the job training today. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That's what they get. They get this on on the job. On the job training today. Believe you that. You know what I'm saying? That. Believe that. But man, man give, give me some everyday ish that you did that you've been dealing with you know, the been, last couple of days. I've been I've been talking a little shit for the past couple of days with the comments that your boy Young Thug said about Andre 3000. Oh, oh my God! If you're familiar with it, you know what I'm talking about. Uh, the nigga Andre 3000 was like, I mean, excuse me, the nigga Young Thug was like, you know, he don't see what the big fuss it is. Uh, the big fuss it is about Andre 3000 is like the music is mediocre and it's not hard like that. First of all, I'm going to tell you what bothered me. Mm. Because in the 90s, you know, when the West Coast had this shit on Smash mm. and the New York niggas had this shit on Smash, mm -hmm. that nigga Andre 3000. Went up to New York City. Was a nervous wreck when he got up there. And what did he say, Philo? He said, hey, niggas is doing this and niggas is saying that, but the, the South got something to say. Oh. Like, like, he didn't say it with malicious intent, yeah. but he was serious. And, like, from that point on, <laughs> Outkast, Goody Mark, <laughs> Dungeon Fam. You know Come that? on, we're going to keep it rolling. You know if that? it won't for them niggas. It wouldn't be no fucking young thug. Come on, cuz. Uh, you you the same nigga that you preaching again. Cuz you the same nigga that Tabernacles. 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 <laughs> Church, bitch. Church. Straight up, nigga. So you know, but but that's what I'm saying. This nigga young thug, if it won't for for Andre 3000. Yeah. If it won't for Outkast, them niggas in Atlanta, yeah. he wouldn't even have a lane. Yeah. Yeah, like Atlanta been cracking the whole time music been No. no. Nigga, that shit was just like Marsville, Henry County. Yeah. Desolate. Desolate. Come on, man. Cut the shit so, you know, niggas get a little bad. 